Prairie cicadas are small and early. They are tiny creatures among their kin, like these big and colorful annual or bush cicadas two and a half inches long that arrive in July from forest and grasslands. But the little ones show up in May, crawling out of the soil where their larvae feed on forb and grass roots, and their clothing is plain. Above ground, they basically mate, lay eggs, and die. But they must be good eating, for a host of wildlife seeks them out for food. They are robust bugs for early season, a good-sized meal. Skunks grub the emerging cicadas from the soil. Birds seek them for their young. Here, a lark sparrow carries two to its waiting youngsters. And even wasps tear the soft and meaty prairie cicadas apart, eating them for protein and moisture. Larger cicadas are better armored and too hard even for the powerful jaws of wasps. But this little snack makes easy pickings and the formidable paper wasp eats its fill and then cuts the victim in half. It carries a chunk back to its own nest for storage in wasp egg cells. Nature provides for all at every season. And even in an active food chain, there's always enough extras to ensure groceries for the next generation. I'm Mike Blair in the Kansas Outdoors.